Whose idea was it to roll down that hill? <laughs> you know, nobody will ever be able to take this day away from us. Yeah. The woods were so quiet. It's just like you told me all those times when I was in jail. We were completely alone. Yeah, felt like that. Except for the snow angels, of course. Yeah. Maybe that wasn't such a good idea, making the snow angels. Oh. They're probably all covered up by now. Uh, what if somebody saw us? Like who? Those kids at the pond. They weren't even looking in our direction. As far as we know. Xander. As far as I'm concerned, we were the only ones in the world today. It's just the woods, and the sky, and the snow, and the angels, and us. Yeah. Oh, my hands must be freezing. I'm sorry. Maybe our last. How about tonight? Why don't we just stay here one more night? It's too dangerous. I mean, Sorrell's men could be right down the street right now. The cops could have this whole building surrounded. Yeah, but, uh, Sander, they would have moved in on us by now. I jumped bail on Sonny Corinthos. I left my lawyer out high and dry. You could be an official runaway by now. We're already pushing our luck. But we're safe here. Yeah. But if I turn myself in, I might be able to get bail again. I know you will. I... But if I, if I let myself get arrested, I could end up in jail for years. And if I get arrested here, with you, sometime in the middle of the night, both you and Elizabeth could end up accomplices. I didn't think about it that way. Yeah. Let me take you. No, we're going to the police station tonight. Oh, hey. I came out there to get you, to take you home, and that's what I'm going to do. Xander, then what? I'm going to turn myself in, tonight, I promise. Don't you wish we could just stay here for the rest of the winter? Yeah, I wish a lot of things. All right, I'm fine. Man, what do you care? You should be in jail. You let him ship Emily out of here like she's nothing. I'm home. That's all that matters. Emily! Emily, are you all right? Of course. Xander brought me home. Where are you going, Sweetie. you coward? What was that? I'm going to call the police. No, don't, please. Xander's on his way to turn himself in, okay? Is that what he told you? Yeah. You're a liar. Xander, just go. Just leave. Okay? You kicked your own daughter out and you call me a coward? We did not kick her out. You, you call me a liar? Well, let's just be glad that Emily's home, all right? Don't you know how brave she is, how smart? Just shut up and stay away from or her. what? That's enough. Get out. Hey, watch it. Look, I'm glad you brought my sister home. Now get out. Hey, stop both of you, here. Do not call the cops, Mom. You're starting to sound like a criminal. Yeah, because that's how you treat her. Stop, all of you, please. You actually believe themselves in, do you? Listen, you need to leave right now, okay? Show them how wrong they are. Go, Sam. Get out of this house. What you make me? Poker's right over there. Listen to me. Don't you realize how much Xander has done for me? He skipped bail. And Sonny Corinthos, no less. He came all the way across the country to make sure that I got home safely. You would still be in St. Catharines if he hadn't come across Dad, the country. Dad, that's because I was halfway out the window. I had enough money to get to Iowa. Iowa? Yeah, and then Xander showed up. How could you dump your daughter in California without any money? Emily, you have shown extremely poor judgment. Dad, I was planning on running away, okay? 
And I would do it again! Xander's my friend! I'm not just gonna leave him here! Can't you see he's ruining your life? Can't you see that my life makes sense for the first time? Xander put his life out on the line for me! Doesn't that count for anything? The fugitive Xander Smith. He's at the quarter main residence. Of course, now. You just send a squad car here immediately. It's Edward Quartermain, who else? And I want that deviant immediately. I'm very sorry to upset you, Grandmother. Thank you, Xander, for bringing Emily home. Oh, you're welcome. Not a step closer. Hey, we all love her very much. Well, I know that you do. <sighs> Can't you listen to Grandmother for once in your life, please? <sighs> You'll call Alexis. Oh, Emily's your secretary now, is that right? Yeah, go. Xander, go and, um, I'll try to come visit you down at the station. Xander Smith, you're under arrest. You have the right to remain silent. Anything you say can and will be used against you in the court of law. You can't You have do the this. right hey. to have an attorney present during questioning. If you cannot afford one, one will be appointed. Who called the police? The Who was it? Was it you, Xander's grandfather? I've read them to you. Man, what They're gonna take him to jail now. They're gonna kill him. 